6846 Baltimore Annapolis Boulevard. Front porch doesn't look to be in good shape. Looks like they put plywood over something else. Rotten out. Needs all new siding, windows, and I think it needs a new roof, maybe just repairs. Yeah, I go in the back door. Siding's like wood, I believe. Yeah, it's wooden siding. Air handle looks super old. Backyard, it's good size. It's got this pool. It doesn't seem to be in very good shape when I look under the tarp. This annoying ass dog that hasn't stopped barking since I got here. And it's scary looking. But nice backyard. Um, oh yeah, the pool's in horrible condition if you see. It's all kind of erosion and uh, the concrete splitting. Yeah, the pool is no good. Um, kind of nice about it, it backs up to woods. No, neighbor, no neighbors behind. Right, look at this way. There you go. There's no concrete for a driveway either. This deck, a little better than the front one, just some repairs maybe. All right, walk in the back door, teeny little kitchen, pantry area, whatever you want to call that. It's not really a dining area, but. Through here, just be the dining area. It's all drywall, but it's definitely in rough condition. New baseboard. And a nice big open living area. Front door. Here's a full bath, only full bath, only bathroom the house has. Plumbing's good as far as I can tell. All the copper's still in the house and connected. Not a huge bathroom, it's not teeny though. And a bedroom on this floor. Has no closet. So that's the return air, which I've never seen. Like, well, actually, I yeah. have. But got a little damage. Upstairs. There's where that runs to the return. I want damage. Even just stuff like this cracking in the drywall. Basically everywhere. All right, first bedroom up here. 
It's okay size, but you notice the slanted ceilings and its textured ceilings. Over to this bedroom. Same same kind of layout, slanted ceilings. Whole closet. Notice how this ceiling is like it's tall. And the basement. Stairs aren't very sturdy. <laughs> Back door. Ceilings are too short, like 6'2 to the joists. And you see all the coppers. It looks good. And it looks good all the way up to the sink. Some repairs. It's probably leaks. Some repairs needed. But all the coppers here. It's not galvanized. Hot water here is rusty at the bottom. And the panel. It's 100 amp. The wiring still looks good in the house, as far as I can tell. The amp, or the panel, it might need a new panel. I'm really not sure. And there comes our uh, return air supply. Not very uh, appealing. Probably need. We run that. All I need. And the unit's super old.